Stan Lee, the living legend, the immortal face of Marvel Comics. I think I speak for everyone when I say that I am absolutely grateful that this man does so much convention appearances and presenting us with opportunities to meet the man himself as well as create memories and give thanks to him in person in our own special ways. And this video that I'm making and sharing with all you guys is my own personal experience as well as my own personal thank you to Stan Lee himself. Now I've been to three conventions where Stan Lee's been a guest at and for those who don't know when he's out on the convention floor or in public they really enforce the rules of no pictures allowed by any attendees even if you were in line for an autograph with him so when they see people trying to take pictures they usually go shout out no pictures and put your hand out like this or they get in their bodies and if they persist they escort them away and I'm guessing if depending on the convention rules if they continue to persist then they'll probably get kicked out but I personally haven't heard any cases like that if any of y'all have I guess let me know in the comments when I was in line for Stan Lee's autograph they really blocked his view of people who try to get a picture of them but do we ever listen now I know this picture doesn't look clear as day but you have to understand that this was taken in a hurry and there's a bit of blur motion in the picture but Stan Lee as you can see is visible enough to recognize now I really tried to get video of Stan Lee for you guys but it was just way too difficult but not impossible Now I also had a photo op with Stan Lee scheduled later on in the day and while I was waiting for the line to form I was just walking around killing time and I happened to be in the right place at the right time when a family of attendees told me that they were tired and would like to leave early and they had a ticket for a photo op with the actress from Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D., Ming-Na Wen, and they were just looking to get rid of it. So when they saw me walk by them, they asked me if I would like to have their ticket. And I had just came back from watching Ming-Na Wen's Q&A, and I was like, sure. Now since I had a ticket to get a photo op with Ming Na Wen and her line had not yet started forming, I walked around a little bit and I happened to run into my convention friends Mario and Luigi. Now after my photo with Ming Na Wen was taken, I immediately rushed back to the line of the photo ops because Stan Lee's line was pre-forming next to Ming Na Wen's. And once Ming Na Wen's line 
was done, Stanley's line moved into place. And it was quite a wait. I think the wait was about over an hour. But I made a couple of new friends while waiting in line. And I talked to them every now and then. But finally, the time had come for my photo op with Stan Lee. So when I walked in, I immediately shook his hand and I said, Hey Stan. And he's like, Hey, how you do it? Then I stood next to him, took off my glasses to avoid any glare from the flash. And I said, let me fix my hair a little bit. I don't know if it really helped if you look at the picture. Then I put my arm behind him, the picture was taken, and right after the flash was done, Stanley told me, you couldn't have looked more perfect. I put my glasses back on, I shake his hand once again, and I tell him, thank you for all your hard work. He laughs and is like, okay. And then I take off because a lot of people are waiting for their photo op. So that was Dallas Comic Con. It was so worth the long travel for me to show you my experience. And for the next video, it's going to be Alamo City Comic Con, which is more closer to home for me. And I have lots to show you for that. So in the meantime, enjoy my photos from Dallas Comic Con.